Hi guys, it's Forever Madison and I'm back to talk to you guys about the hair that I have in my head today. I installed this hair last week Sunday, so as of tomorrow it will be officially one week of having this hair in, but well, one week in a day because I actually installed the hair on Sunday or Saturday. I don't remember. Yeah, Saturday. So actually a week and two days. Well, I guess it's a week and a day, yeah, as of today. Um, and this hair, I mean, I like this hair a lot, especially for the price. The price is $9.99 a pack, but in my hair store, they charge $13 for this, and this is a 22 inch. And the reason why they charge so cheap is because it's Futura Fibers, which is kind of like Kinkalon, um, but it can be straightened and curled. And everything else. Um, it's off. The name over here is called Bobby Walls Forever Premium Hair Select Weave Selection, and it looks like this. And I got a number two. This one says 18 inch because I have a 22 inch on the bottom and an 18 inch on the top. Um, I my original plan was to get two 22s, but they only had one 18 inch and a number two, and no, one number two and 22 inches. And then, so my mom got me a 18 inch. Um, the hair was actually 13 bucks. No, 11 bucks, I think. No, 13. It was 12 something for the 22 inch. But some hair stores sell it for um, $10. Um, every length, just 10 bucks. Uh, as far as the hair goes, the cons and pros about the hair. The pros are the price and the styles you're able to create with this hair look. I have the Kim Kardashian curls in it, and I actually didn't curl it this morning. This is from homecoming last night, because I went, like I had told you guys in my previous video. I think I mentioned that. Um, yeah, so I just wrap it up like this at night, and I just did that when I got in the house. And I put my bonnet on, and I just took it down this morning. And I combed through it. Um, another pro. Um... It, yeah, basically just the price. And it, you know, it looks like human hair. Uh, but after a certain time, it gets bad. Like, mine does, like, it gets stiff. Like, mine's just starting to get stiff, but I just combed it out. Like, my ends, like, they keep, like, getting longer, so I have to cut the ends a lot because it sheds. Um, now on to the cons about this hair. The hair sheds, it tangles. I just had to, um, tangle it, like, the first day, like, my hair, like, I couldn't run my hands through it. Like, like, even now, it's, like, pretty hard to run my hands through it. But it looks good. And I think someone, for someone who wants a cheap hairstyle and doesn't have all that money to spend on the hair, I would definitely recommend this. It's not all bad, especially, like, if you know what you're doing. Now, it does curl. I actually curl with my chi. And it says, don't curl with the chi. Well, it doesn't say don't curl with the chi, but it says uh, it can be heated up to 320, I think. Um, but I actually use my chi on it because, yeah, just, you know, it's a feather in my bangs. And the reason why my hair is falling the way it is because of the way I cut it. Now, I came to you guys to do this video because I wanted to show you guys that no matter how cheap your hair is, you can still get nice hairstyles. Like, I can do Kim Kardashian curls with this hair, like, you know. This is basically like you know the bombshell look, little feather bangs. It's it's you're able to achieve it with cheaper hair. You don't have to spend a hundred dollars on the version hair, even though I am gonna get me some when I get me a job. But you don't have to spend it if you don't have it. Like you know, some of you guys have kids. Like you have other responsibilities. You can't throw away a hundred dollars on some hair just because it just came out and because you want to try it. You know, you got to be realistic. So I think this hair is realistic. But, you know, it might be able to last you two weeks. Um, hopefully, I'm trying to get it to last me a month. So I'm going to be doing updates. Uh, I meant to come to you guys into the video the first day I put it in. But, um, I was just tired and, um, you know, I don't know. I just, I knew I needed to do the video, but I didn't. Um, another thing is, when I curl this hair, I noticed that, um, when I do the curls, like I did the curl with my curl line and it dropped. Like I put it to the back to do the rest of my hair 
And I put it back, it was like straight again. And I'm like, well. So now the way I curl this here is I put water on it. And that's, I think that's why. I think me putting the water on it is what's going to let me um have this hair for about a month. Because, you know, I'm using water. So every time I use the water, it's kind of like I'm renewing the hair. Um, I actually washed the hair last night. And it still is back to where it was. But I did put water in again after it to curl it. Um, my ends, they're not, they're a little frizzy, but I'm going to cut it, but it's like, it's not, it's nothing I can't handle. Um, for this hair, like, you know, you might want to do your research, like, you know, how to take care of this type of hair, because it's not for everyone, you know, some people just do better with human hair, you don't want to have to go through all this. Um, yeah, so... Let me talk to you guys about how I got my layering. I watched a um, YouTube video by, I know her name, and I actually like her. I don't know, but let me tell you what she did. You're going to part, I'll do another video, but I'm just going to tell you in this video. You section your hair, like you know, you're going to take about this much, put that back, take about this much from that side too, and you're going to put away your bang pieces, whatever you want your bang to be. Tie that up, and then from here, what you're gonna do, you're gonna. I measured from like right here, and then I went like that, and I start cutting from there. And you're gonna, just gonna cut down on an angle. And you're gonna do the same thing for the other side. And then when you get here, you're gonna. I put my right here, and then I just cut this one down on the angle too. And that's how I got my feathers. And then the back just stays straight, but when you curl it, it's gonna do that. So that's how I got my layers. Um. This video is getting pretty long, so I'm just going to uh, talk to you guys about what I put in the hair. Um, I use heat protectant on my real hair. Um, this is the heat protectant I use. I need to get some more because look how much I don't have in a lot left. I don't know if you can see it. Um, I also use to blend in. I add some of this on the top, just a little bit in my hands. My Argon Magic Intensive Hair Oil. Um, the Moroccan Beauty Secret. Um, this, I know it doesn't have the top, the top's in my room. Also had the Peter Coppola. This thing smells really good, but I think the Peter Coppola one smelled even better. I just did this. Um, by the way, these wraps are pretty thin, but, um, oh, another good thing about the hair is that, um, that one pack, I put one pack in my head, the 22 inches stop like right here. I made all up here, so I double weft it, the 18 inch, and but I have like a little space back here because I was spacing it out. Um, I, this is my first sewing that I ever did on myself. Um, another product I use is the Olive Angry Mousse. Um, I use that on it just to like I put some in the water. Like I get a bowl of water just like this, fill it up with water, spray some of this in it, stir it in. And when I curl my hair, I just wet it with that. And then I roll it up and curl my so wait for the steam to drop. Um, I use this paddle brush to brush the hair out. As you can see, some of the hair is in the paddle brush. Um, as far as flexi rods go, it doesn't hold flexi rod. Like, it doesn't... It doesn't take flexi rods. Like, it doesn't... Overnight, if you don't curl it... Like, I've curled my hair, then rolled it up in the flexi rod and took it down in the morning. And it was curly, but you might you're gonna have to curl your hair first. Unless like it's already curled and you roll it up, your curls that might stay. But as far as your hair being straight and you trying to get curls using this, no. Um, unless you guys know a secret that I don't know. Um, not too many people do reviews on this hair, and I think they should. So that's why I'm here to do it and tell you guys about it. Um, cause I love this hair, you know. Um, this is like one of those emergency hairs. Uh. Even though I did a solo with it, you guys could do a quick weave with it. Um, but, yeah, you could do a quick weave with this hair. Um, but I just did a sewing. This is my first sewing. And I think for somebody who wants to do their first sewing, they should use a cheaper hair. And this is a cheaper hair. You know, you can you can achieve the Kim Kardashian girls with this hair. You can use the wand on this hair. Like, you know, um... I've heard good and bad reviews about this hair. It's almost, there's only a number of reviews on this hair. 
I guess really not a lot of reviews. Um, which kind of sucks because, you know, you guys want a cheaper hair and this hair can curl. There's other hair like this too that some people probably get. Um, but where are the reviews at? Start doing reviews. If you have a hair that you don't think we know about that's cheap, do a review for us. Because, you know, this is our community and we need to help each other out with the hair. Um, I don't have a quote of the day like I said I would, but I'm going to tell y'all this. Um, if you're having a bad day, don't let your bad day make somebody else have a bad day. That's my quote of the day. Yeah, because, you know, it's not fair to them. Because the people that care about you, just because you're having a bad day, you don't need to take it out on them. Especially not when they're trying to find out what's wrong with you. Yes, it is personal. It is personal. But um, that is my quote of the day. But yeah, I love the hair. So I'm going to let you guys see the back. I don't know what it looks like back there. It probably looks hot rat man. Rat nest mess. Um, but yeah, I just wear it side, like to the side. Because, um, I don't know. I, I like this hair. Um, um, I took some pictures. The one I did my sister's hair. I did hers too. Um, but she has a, she has more hair left out. I only left out, like, from hair, like, this much hair. I don't have no hair on the sides left out. Nope. Um, yeah, but my sister's hair, I left more hair out. She has a whole perimeter out and, like, a lot of this out. But, yeah. Like, she doesn't really curl hair as much as I do, so. Um, she's new to the hair thing, so. Um, yeah, for a first time weaver, I don't know if I suggest this hair. Because you might, you might hate weave because of this hair. I mean, it's not bad for everyone, like, you know. I'm used to taking care of hair because I did crochet braids with the kink line here. And I was, like, blow drying my hair every night because when it gets a little poofy. But, um, yeah, I mean, maintenance. I like this hair. I'm going to be getting it again. I'm probably going to be installing it again unless I run into a little more money. But like 26 bucks for your hair, for your hair, you know, that's not bad at all. But I'll be doing another video showing pictures of, I'll do another talking tutorial with pictures of her install because I took a lot of pictures for her install and I meant to put together a video. So I might go ahead and do it right now. Um, so yeah, um, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I also want to say hi to my new subscribers, two of you guys. Um, I appreciate you guys for subscribing. And hopefully more of you guys will join me in my weave journey. And you can see what I do with my weave. And, um, yeah, just, you can just get to know me, you know. If there's anything else that you guys want me to do. Like makeup tutorials, stuff like that. I mean, I don't have any makeup on right now, but I actually do wear makeup. And I'm pretty good at makeup. Like, I'm good at makeup here. And, um, you know, I could do an outfit of the day. Um, I, today I just have on this little blazer. This little see-through purple shirt. Um, sorry if you could see anything. Uh, I just threw this on for the video. I have pajama pants on. But, um, yeah, I just needed to look good from top to bottom well top waist up needs to look good um but yeah I love this hair I really do um so goodbye guys